You might pay 500 bucks for an iPad or even 600 for a Motorola Zoom. But as Lindsay Masters shows us, there are people who have figured out how to save hundreds by turning their nooks into these higher end tablets. Here it is, the Nook Color. Barnes & Noble sells it for 250 bucks. It's an e-reader designed for people to purchase and download books and magazines. It even has web access via Wi-Fi. The Nook runs on an Android operating system. Like parental controls on a TV, only certain features can be accessed. But there's a way to modify the Nook, taking those controls off and transforming the Nook into a more expensive tablet kind of like an iPad. So, How much yeah. do you think you saved? Uh, easily $150. Armed with instructions from online forums, Doug turned his Nook Color into an Android tablet. Only takes a couple of hours. He bought a digital card for about 20 bucks, loaded in the software, and then popped it into his Nook. The process is called rooting. It gives you root access, then you can install whatever you want. Doug downloaded apps like the extremely popular game Angry Birds and YouTube. Extra. It's not terrible. He even downloaded Nook's competitor. Using the, the Kindle app to read Amazon ebooks. Before rooting, Doug had to purchase books for his Nook from Barnes & Noble. Now he has access to Amazon's Kindle library. Which I'm sure Barnes & Noble probably isn't too happy about. But Doug says rooting doesn't give him all the benefits of a full tablet. It doesn't have a camera and it doesn't have built-in GPS. Then there's the warranty issue. Rooting a Nook voids the warranty, but Doug says he's found a way to get around it by running the operating system off his digital card. He can take the card out and the device goes right back to being a Nook only. Now, there's a good possibility that they'll never know. I'm Lindsay Mastis, 9 News Now. Okay, what you got to ask, is this legal? Barnes & Noble declined to comment on that story, except to say, rooting a nook voids the warranty. So we decided to ask an attorney whether rooting is legal, and Lindsay Masses will be back here tomorrow morning at 6.45 a.m. with that.